Hey guys, it is Cheesy here, and today I am bringing you a video on Fallout 4 Nuka World, which is the last DLC for Fallout 4. I'll be talking about the release date that was revealed and what this means for Fallout 4, as well as discussing my expectations for the DLC. So first up, we have the alleged release date on August 30th. This is pretty obvious, however, it seems kind of early. Obviously, it isn't really that bad, but... Considering this is the last DLC for Fallout 4, it kind of seems like Fallout has had a pretty short lifespan. This means that after next month, there will be no more new content. Now this is not that bad because of one reason, mods will allow Fallout 4 to be played for years to come. But this is still kind of disappointing. With a bit of lack of content in the main game compared to older Fallouts, it's kind of sad to see that we will only get three DLCs which really added new stuff with, uh, Automatron, Far Harbor, and now Nuka World. It was also mentioned that the developers will only support Fallout 4 until 2017. Now 2017 is next year, and once again, while modding tools will provide us with all kinds of opportunities, I think that there's a big chance that Fallout 4 may be kind of forgotten soon. And Fallout 4 definitely has not had the impact that older Fallout 4 games have had. And so I really think that Obsidian should make another Fallout game. Onto my expectations for the DLC, there's only one thing that I really want, and that is choice and karma. Uh, my best videos are showing you guys what happens when I kill off an essential character in Fallout 4, whereas in New Vegas, I could kill anybody I wanted. Recently, I got back into New Vegas, and I was even going to make a video about it, and every settlement in the Mojave has a karma ranking. In Quest, you have so many choices, and really, it almost seems like a different game compared to Fallout 4. So in Nuka World, I hope that you'll be able to do anything you want. You'll be playing as a raider, and so it seems only fitting that you should be able to do anything you want, whether it's that's raiding a settlement, or like raiding a caravan, or even just killing a fellow raider or killing everybody in Nuka World. Like, you should be able to do that as a raider especially, or just like in Fallout. Like, you know, that's, that, that's uh, what Fallout is at its core, or at least that's what it was. So that is pretty much it for this video, guys. Thank you for watching. I have a bunch of other Fallout 4 content you should definitely check out if you like this one. This was just a quick news update, however. Uh, later today, I'll have out my Fallout 4 console mods of the week, as it is Monday. But once again, thank you guys for watching, and make sure to subscribe for more Fallout 4 content. Also, don't forget to leave a like and drop a comment on what you think about what Fallout 4 Nuka World should have. But for now, I will see you guys later. Bye.